make them bounce. We continue to watch the tropics very closely. Soon to be tropical storm Nate. Again, uh, movement here is off toward the north and the west. And what we've noticed over the last several hours, some deeper thunderstorm activity just off to the east of the circulation center. What does that mean? Well, we are looking at uh, perhaps some reorganization here of the internal structure, the core of the system. That would indicate down the road the potential here for some further strengthening. Tropical storm warnings already in effect here throughout portions of Honduras down toward Nicaragua. Also notice points to the north where we do have hurricane watches in effect. That means tropical storm force winds are expected within the next 48 hours. In addition to the winds and the biggest concern here throughout the short term and really into tonight and even into early Friday is going to be the amount of rain that comes out again of uh, this system here throughout eastern Nicaragua, eastern Honduras. Eastern Nicaragua could see 10 to 20, locally 30 inches of rain. And that will cause mudslides and also life-threatening catastrophic flash flooding. Now, as it again makes its move just inland here, brushing the coastline a little further inland, we're not going to be looking at rapid strengthening. But as we go through time and this reemerges into the northwestern Caribbean, we are concerned about further strengthening. Climatologically speaking, this is an area that we often look to this time of the year because of the fronts that are dipping their way down into the lower 48. So again, favorable for strengthening. We talk about warm water. We talk about low amounts of wind higher up in the atmosphere. That's wind shear. And also we're going to be talking about uh, no dry air round. But there will be some land interaction. Heavy rainfall, like I said, today, tonight, tomorrow. This makes its move toward the Yucatan, though, as we venture in toward Friday. And Friday night emerges into the Gulf of Mexico early Saturday morning. All interest here from the central Gulf Coast states. Points eastbound should continue to monitor the progress of soon-to-be-nate very, very closely.